Live and local from Fox 7 News, this is Good Day Austin. Welcome back, everyone. Time to talk Safe Kids Austin. Today we are touching on the subject of sleep safety for babies. want to welcome Randy Charba. He is the captain of the Austin Travis County EMS. Welcome back to the show, Randy. Great to have you here. Thanks for having me back. Um, SIDS, uh, spell that out for us. Sudden Infant Death, Death Syndrome, syndrome yep. is what it is. And it can really happen to, uh, to anybody. What kind of statistics do we have right now? So October is um, Safe Sleep, sleep Month. Mm -hmm. And so we're trying to get the word out about safe sleep practices. Um, you know, unsafe sleep related deaths have now become the number one cause of death for infants aged one month through 12 months. Oh. And if we look at uh, the statistics from 2014 here in Travis County, we had 13 infants who died all related to unsafe sleep practices and 11 of those 13 infants were uh, deaths occurred in, in adult beds. Is this just in one year, those 13 deaths that you're referring to or is it a, over a period of time? That, that was just for just Travis County for 2014. Oh, and when okay. we look at national statistics, that um, kind of that 11 out of 13 in adult beds, that 90% of these deaths are occurring in adult beds, so it kind of parallels the national statistics. Um, tell us about the hazards. Well, how does it happen? Where does it happen? Yeah, so. Infants don't have poor, they have poor head control, right? They lack the muscle structures and tones. Right here support, on their on their neck. Yeah, support that big head of theirs. And so, if they get their face into something soft or plush, or if something gets on their face, they lack also that motor dexterity to remove it. Those um, that could cause them to have breathing difficulties and cause them to suffocate. So, what are the best practices for our parents? So, we really want parents to be aware that first they need to put their babies down on their backs. Mm -hmm. Okay, there needs to be a firm surface and their sleep area needs to be free of any hazards. So hazards are anything soft, anything that can form a, a pocket when you push on it. So blankets, pillows, toys, bumpers around the crib. Those oh. are all can be hazards. You don't think about the bumpers or, or around the crib. I often thought of, of blankets. And we're seeing there's some video and those bumpers right there because they are so decorative and they're part of what comes with the crib bedding. I really haven't thought about that at all. Absolutely. If a, a child uh, rolls over and gets their face wedged between the mattress and the bumper, <gasps> that can form that pocket and cause them not to get the oxygen that they need and will cause them to suffocate and die. Yeah, I always think of the, uh, the tight swaddling, which is so important to keep them in that sleep stage but you don't think about something else right and you think they're right. going to be cold sure. right that's why you put another absolutely. blanket on them absolutely these deaths are occurring to great parents the parents are just unaware of the hazards mm -hmm. and dangers associated with certain behaviors and so that's why we're really trying to get the message out okay well randy we can't thank you enough for all of this and of course we will be posting um this segment on our Facebook page and we'll, I'll be sharing it and all that stuff because we need to know especially for new parents out there. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Okay. Thanks Randy. Okay.